number three. As you can see, it's lovely and sunny outside. We're hoping you're having a safe and lovely time in your garden. A big shout out to all the grown-ups at home who are keeping you safe, fed and entertained. Here's what's coming up on today's show. is really starting to fill up as you can see so keep sending all of the things that you're doing at home to homework at hogarthacademy.co.uk lots of you have sent in a lot more learning from home and it all looks fantastic we've had some wonderful writing from william some amazing windmills by scarlett and finley and some amazing math, shout out to Miss Walker, who looks like she's been doing a lot at home. Ava and Alice Rumbold doing some lovely maths colouring. And Amelia, which looks like maths as well. Well done guys, keep up the hard work. Thank you to Mr Lynch who set last week's competition to write an acrostic poem about anything to do with school. Let's have a closer look. Well done to Libby Stevenson who wrote a fantastic poem about school and how much she misses things. We miss you too Libby. Well done to William who also wrote one about school and a big shout out to the lollipop lady too, Mrs Carlton, thank you. Well done to Alice who wrote a beautiful springtime poem and I really love the words green and luscious in there. And our winners this week go to Grace Cook with her poem about school, science, creativity, having fun, outside activities, our class and lovely teachers. Then we go to Riley, who's done sports with Mr Haxby, children playing nicely, homework set by Mrs Rowley, outside playing football on the field, our children learning our times table, library times, there's lots to read. And a fantastic poem by Rahan, who gives everyone a mention in this. Happy at school is far away, over until the lockdown goes away. Great friends and teachers miss today, away virus go today. Ready for school, can't wait to come back. Thinking of my class, hoping they're safe. Hooray, hooray, Team Hogarth. Well done to our three competition winners, Grace, Riley and Rahan, who will all be receiving a chocolate Easter egg delivered today. Special mention goes to Mrs Beeson, who went to the effort of making her own acrostic poem. Hogarth is so wonderful and full of learning and fun, giving each other help and being kind to one another. Remembering that even though myself and all the teachers aren't there by your side every day, Hogarth is sending you all lots of love. Hogarth is the best. Stay safe, everyone. Mrs Beeson. <laughs> time this week we've had lots of pictures from lots of children baking things at home here is William looks like a nice milkshake and cooking up a storm in the kitchen over there we've had Riley they look like gorgeous cupcakes Riley I hope you saved me one and we've had some yummy pizza French bread made by Chelsea which looks lovely and we've also had Ruby Ray and Charlie making homemade pizzas which look delicious.
our boiled egg competition. We want you to boil an egg, decorate it, take a photograph of it and send it in to homework at hogarthacademy.co.uk. One year I made a minion. And I made a cat in the hat. Get cracking! Good morning Hogarth. It's lovely to be with you on our third episode of Good Morning Hogarth. I hope you're all enjoying the sunshine and spending time with your families and doing that schoolwork from home. Easter is a time to be thankful and be thankful for our loved ones, be they near or far. I know we're missing you as much as you're missing us and we hope to see you very soon. Stay safe, stay at home, take care, see you soon.